1977 Mercury Cougar last stop this was the fourth generation of the Mercury Cougar produced from 1977 to 79 this one has the 351 Windsor engine only a two barrel carb These cars had massive long hoods. Check the interior. The door panel is pretty uh, basic. Doesn't have, for instance, the door panel uh, courtesy lights. That power window somebody took. It is in uh, decent condition for the age that it is. Headliner is all sagging. Somebody already took out the cluster but left it here. It's an 85 mile per hour speedometer. Uh, coolant temperature, gauge. The rest are just warning lights for oil and brake, fuel gauge, there's alternator, high beam, 93,796, I believe this is correct and it's not 193, looking at the condition of the engine. It's an A track. And an AM FM stereo. Had air conditioner. The leg room in the back is not much. Even though the rear seat has been removed and thrown there. But you can tell it didn't have much of a legroom considering its immense size. Somebody wrote the ultimate cruising machine. Seventy-seven. The trunk kind of shallow, as you can see. Not very deep. So with a full size spare, you would have had not much room in the trunk of this car. The Mercury emblem is damaged and broken. This is the original color. Fix or repair daily. <laughs> that Ford from ultimate cruising machine to fix or repair daily. At the Landau top, long gone. This quarter window back here. the wheels look like the grill wood ornament is gone uh, there's the 351 water an air conditioned car Still has the factory stickers on the valve cover. 
This is why I believe this has an original Mars only 93,000. It's pretty neat. The valve covers are still retain the original paint from back in the day. Seventy seven Cougar last stop.